He was a funny man. <laughs> a very funny man. I said to Nat, Nat, I said, Alfie, Alfie Duffer. He didn't believe me. Stephen, your grandpa should have had top billing. You should never have sold that trickle on my pudding song to Harry Holloway for a fiver. He would have had many more fivers if he kept it. On the other hand, fivers wouldn't have come and sat by his bedside all the time he was ill. No, but a beautiful nurse would have done. Stephen, I remember him as a handsome baritone. Tenor? No, he was a baritone. No, a tenor. He sold that song for a tenor. Well, whatever. He was a bloody fool. And, Stephen, are you following in his... Uh, um... No, he's not. Sam Castle. Oh. Uh, your father told me you were there. You were there for his curtain call. Well... I mean, how did he finally... By focals. By what? Well, he wasn't wearing them when he read the label on his new linktus. Took half a cupful instead of half a capful. Oh, like I said, he should have gone into a home. I should not. What? Been in a home. Ach. Yedne, Alfie, my starry drug, Umer. Ons nae sio, la musica, i cirk, i si chas, Umer. than the one in Paris, France, and half the price. 3,000 fish from all over the world. Pick which one you like, madam, and you put it on your ship tonight. <laughs> Something very good. Five floors of entertainment. 3,000 fish from all over the world. Boss in the bag. 3,000 fish from all over the world. Dance into the sound of the big world, it's done. Look, I've been through my granddad's things, and this is all I want, all right? What do you want with sheet music? You can't read it. You look a right burke in that suit, just like he did, the one he was buried in. Dead smart, that Reggie! 3,000 suits from all over the world. Fish. little Reggie is for you to sing your dad's treacle song. Cumbering, smothering, don't you stop till you can't see putting for treacle on the top. Reggie!
Kiss me, honey, honey, kiss me. Thrill me, honey, honey, thrill me. Don't care even if I blow my top. Honey, honey, don't stop. Right. I'm keeping my hand in, Mr. Duffel. Working in my mother's fancy dress hire shop. Well, it's a costumier's, really. Professionals do go there. Well, then, Stephen's got a suit to sell you. Yes, he can pop it in whenever he likes. <laughs> said the actress. Actress, not quite. But musical comedy, certainly. Right. Thank you very much, ladies. <laughs> what were they called again? Sex on legs. Oh, God. This is a galleon, Sonny. Not top of the chart, poppers. Right, well, let's be having you. This afternoon, we have for you a young singer and two comics who are very, very funny. So I hope you enjoy them. Now, on my wedding day, well, we didn't have a big display. No, just greens and potatoes and a little bit of meat. And my wife made a boiled suet pudding for a treat. Nice, I had a little bit of pudding for myself. Oh, well, I felt like something light. I said, now, mate, it's a time to celebrate this most important night. So, put a bit of treacle on me pudding, Mary Ann, Mary Ann, Mary Ann, Mary Ann. Go on, cover it small, don't you? Stop till you can't see the pudding. Put a treacle on the top now. I like a pudding if the pudding's a good one. I don't want cake or jam. Just put a bit of treacle on, treacle, treacle on, treacle on me pudding, Mary. She knows. I went for a stroll downtown. Try to knock a tram car down. Well, the tram got the best of it. I landed on me head. When I come to me senses, they were putting me to bed. Why well, I called the doctor in, said, You must be suffering, feeling sick and sir. I said, Oh, chick, I'll recover pretty quick and be on my feet once more. If you put a bit of treacle on me pudding, Mary Ann, Mary Ann, Mary Ann, Mary Ann. Oh, I'll cover it. So, no, don't you stop till you can't see the pudding for the treacle on the top. I told you, I like the pudding, and the pudding's a good one. I don't want cake or jam. Just put a bit of treacle on, treacle on me pudding, Mary Ann. 